So today I wanted to do a quick video about my previous post talking about extreme ownership. And it really goes to a comment that January made and I think it's great and I appreciate you January for sharing this. And it's this idea of part of taking ownership is actually letting go. Uh, whether it's forgiving yourself, forgiving someone else, because oftentimes we hold on to negative feelings, thoughts, uh, situations we have with certain people, and that really prevents us from taking ownership. Again, it's like when we say the sentence, you know, this situation makes me feel this way, or this person did something to me that makes me feel this way. That whole thing of saying someone makes you feel something what can be helpful for you is is really changing or rephrasing that sentence because ultimately you're choosing to feel that way so you can also choose to let that go because when you do let that go it no longer has power over you or can stop you from moving forward so think about uh the way in which you hold on to things and something to consider or ponder is take off the rear view mirror just stop looking back and look forward appreciate where you are be grateful for where you are and let go of those feelings of resentment or hurt or or pain that you might carry around that are holding you back and take off the rear view mirror and just look forward and that can really help you take ownership, take ownership of how you feel. And this can really uh, be applied to exercise or nutrition. And I see people when they have a bad workout, they hold on to it and they blame themselves or really hard on themselves for not performing well. What can you learn from the situation? Jot that down and move on. Take off the rear view mirror. Nutrition's the same way, you had a bad meal, went on a little binge, let it go. Take off the rear view mirror and move forward. What can you do today that's gonna to move you closer to your goal? That's what you have to concern yourself with. So in closing here, again, let go of those feelings. You have control over it and take off the rear view mirror. And that way you'll be looking forward and open your eyes to the opportunities in front of you to be a little bit better today. So thanks again, and we'll be back again soon. Again, any comments or things that you're wondering about, please post below, and uh, let's keep this lovely conversation going. Thanks, everybody. Talk soon. Bye-bye.